So it is mega touchdown challenge guys and there is three days and 22 hours left so we have four games to do and the deck that I'm gonna play is this spawner situation. So we have a lot of buildings we're actually building and we are playing SimCity in Clash Royale so basically we have a lot of buildings here it is 3.8 elixir average elixir deck i think it's amazing you're not gonna be disappointed to try it out i think it's one of the best decks to try in mega touchdown charge because it's overwhelming their units you do have a fireball if they play mother witch so you should be in many cases in a good spot so let's start we have four games to do let's do them we are playing against yugo from zelene beretke which is very interesting name very interesting okay so the thing is to play the buildings below the first line and to try to build your pushes here we are gonna try to get as quickly as possible to another tombstone Ooh, he has another witch which can be a pretty difficult situation to handle but we're gonna try to do our best right he's starting very very strong we definitely need to try to get rid of the Mother Witch as soon as possible and hope we will not that one bat no I need to zap it it's okay it's okay it's okay it's fine as long the the situation is like this you guys need to build your units below the first line try to build as much as building as possible keep one building in your hand in the case if your opponent has a big tanky unit we don't have any tanky units so we should be fine we're gonna play our furnace in the back he's gonna go and play very aggressively his tombstone unfortunately currently from all of the buildings i don't have a single one i need um, we're gonna fireball that i think it's a pretty juicy thing to do the prince is very very quick and we're gonna clean all of this nice and easy nice and easy uh ooh, he's playing a minion hard on us which is okay we're gonna go with a firecracker on this side and then we're gonna play the goblin gang on that lane barbarian hut in the house more buildings to protect our units Dark Goblin is a very, very, very good one, especially because it's give you control on the field. And I think it's a great guard goblin here. Okay, we're gonna play the bandit here. The balloon is gonna be on rage. This can be a little bit difficult. A little bit difficult, but we do have a uh, units to handle it. I would say for the air troops, we are pretty saddled. The barbarians are going into the witch. Well, that's unfortunate. Now she's gonna give us all of the piglets in the world. Sadly. I'm gonna play this here. Gonna try to get rid of this piglet down here. She's gonna give us trouble until we get a fireball to destroy her down. Otherwise, a big issue is from the mother witch. Nice. I'm gonna play magic archer here for the minion horde and we look pretty solid as you can see opponents are struggling when you play multiple buildings around so they have a lot of things to handle on the multiple lanes and that makes them a little bit more sweaty right look at that golden army <laughs> golden army on that side ay 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 I mean, this was easy, right? Let's hop into another one. 100 elite bar barbarians is all I, what I need in life, so we have three more to do. I think we can do this. Okay, uh, Mr. I don't know his name, but he's from Asia. At least it looks like it. We're gonna play the tombstone here in the middle. Ooh, elixir golemite. Okay. Uh, t -t 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 we need the building right now okay we're gonna play the goblin hut here he's gonna give us some elixir he's gonna rage this down which is okay we're gonna play more goblins and the elixir is in the house always good to have it nice gonna play the barbarian hut opposite on this side just to spread everything out 
Nice and easy. The units are gonna be pretty much disappointed by by amount of everything we have. We're gonna play the Dark Goblin. It's a very good ground control troop. And it looks like he doesn't have a Mother Witch yet. That doesn't mean he will not have it. Yeah, it looks like he does. I hope the Dark Goblin takes her down. It looks like it will not. Which is very unfortunate. I hope the piglets are not gonna take us down. It's fine. As long as we take those two, we are Gucci. Ah, the blobs. Yeah, we got. We good. We got some elixir done, which is perfect. Just keep the fireball for the mother witch, and you should be good in any matchup. I believe in this deck. Double elixir. A lot of units on multiple sides. We are back. We are back to business. And touchdown! Let's go! So the goblin, since and everything is kind of messing him up, which is great for us. Now we're gonna play another another situational building here. Ooh, he's gonna go with this guy. Okay. Okie dokie. We're gonna try to get rid of it as quickly as possible. So, uh, I was thinking it's not gonna go, but it looks like he would uh, go for the Barbarian Hut. Gonna play the arches here for all of this trooperinos on this side. And now we need to chill, see if we can handle the piglets he's putting on us. Fireball that again. Ah, we're not looking good right now, not gonna lie. We need to hold the line. Looking, looking okay. If the blob are not going, and it's a win for us. Let's go into another one. We have... A little bit more to do. I love the the screen from the executioner. It looks very very lovely. Two more. Greek shadow in the house. Okay, let's see. What is Greek shadow house for us? Maybe nothing. Maybe everything. Ooh, he starts with a ghost. He's starting with heavy trucks. Okay. It's not a big issue, I believe. Better than the Mother Witch, right, chat? Right. Okay, 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 okay. The ghosts are a little bit nastier. Hmm, the firecracker. Not good. Uh, Oops. Oh, no, 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 no. I died. Well played, well played, well played. Ay, 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 ay. Okay, he managed to cross over us, unfortunately. It's not over yet. It's over when we say it's over. Hmm. I desperately need those guys. Those ghosts. He has a he has a, a camp the ghost party. Damn, he's ghost resistant. Looks like it. Ghost resistance. Ooh, he as well has the same thing. Okay. We're getting there. If the bandit is not taking a dab again. She looks like a big issue right now. For us, at least. Okay, we're gonna take this down together. We need to cross it. Unfortunately, it does not look the best for us. But maybe there is a chance. The Spear Goblin. 
The spirit goblin for the touch that one one. We can recover from this. Just believe we can recover definitely from this. Okay. We're gonna play the barbarian barrel here. Again, starts with the ghosts. Very scary things. Damn mm. ghosts. Very big issue. As long as we can take care of the things. He's sweating, yes. <laughs> like to see that. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Good. Let's go, Royal Recruits. Royal Recruits for Mister. Furnace. Goblin Hut. Good. He's in trouble! He's in big, big trouble. Yep, he's losing this battle. Goblins for the win! Whew. We recovered from this. This was a good comeback. 1 HP Esports. Thank you for playing with us. One more game and uh, we got the touchdown. The clean 9-0, I hope. I hope it's gonna be the case. Let's find out. Let's find out if that's gonna be the case or not. I'm gonna play the barb hut here. I'm gonna get rid of him. Good. Yeah, level six. Every card needs to be on level nine, guys. Don't forget that level nine card. It's important thing to know to notice. Otherwise, it's a little bit more trickier. I'm gonna play the Dark Goblin to the, get rid of the Musketeer and we're gonna build our Hot Paradise on this lane. Multiple buildings, always good. Works perfectly fine. Mm, he has a Mega Dude. La Bandita. Not good, but it's what it is. Ooh, it's gonna play graveyard on our spine. As long as we take care of the graveyard, we should be good. For now. I have nothing for the dra for the dragon. I hope he's gonna move a little bit. Hey, the fire spirit for the win. Maurizio, you forgot about the fire spirit on the right side. Okay, one more game. And that should be it. Let's play the barb hut lower. In the middle. Level 7 expo. Yeah, his card levels are... Oh, I missed. <laughs> you guys didn't saw that. I missed. It's okay. We can miss and win. How about that? This is how good this deck is. You can miss and still win the game. Mm -hmm. One minute left. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. 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 Gonna play bar Goblin Hunt. He almost forgot about the Goblin. Mm, the Mega Knight is changing the lane. Ooh, it's a little bit tricky, but it's fine. Still fine. As long as mm, everything is dead here on the field, we should be good. He's going with another graveyard. We have archers ready. Fire Spirit is going. Fire Spirit for the touchdown. <laughs> well, feels good when they need to arrow one Fire Spirit, right? <laughs> feels good. Hey, guys, if you're searching for a best mega touchdown deck, I got you covered. This deck works perfectly fine, I think. And you should not have any issues. Just follow my guidelines about the deck and you should be pretty good. 
So thank you much. Thank you so much for watching. Stick around with me and see you guys in my next one. Bye.